What's going on guys and welcome to another video and in today's video I just want to go over the process that we have whenever we get orders for t-shirts and for us there's two different processes right depends on where the order is coming from or what the order is but before that let me take you where we actually make the shirts which is in the other office and then I'll show you around a little bit and just um, so you can see our setup so let's go All right, so here's our office right now. Looks pretty empty, pretty clean, right? We just got a couple tables. All our shirts are over there, the ones that we keep in stock. Okay, and then right now, this is the main heat press that we're using. We actually have two more. One is a little broken, and the other one I let my friend borrow it, but this is our setup. We have one heat press, and here's where we have certain transfers that we have for uh, the shirts that we sell. Okay, so there's two different types of processes, right? And it all depends on what the order is and how the order comes in. And so the first process I wanna to talk to you guys about is about the shirts that come in through our online store, right? So imagine you have an online store, just pretend, right? If you don't, imagine you have an online store, you're offering different shirts with different designs. The order comes in, right, through your Shopify store. They pay, they order, they put the size num the, they put the size of the shirt, how many, you know, how many shirts do they wanna buy, and that order comes in. So what we do here, here is we take the order from the from the online store and then we go and pick the shirt out boom we grab the shirt we grab the transfer and we make the shirt so it's pretty much that simple like, you know, we keep certain amount of uh, transfers here according to the shirt that we're selling. And we keep some of the inventory, not too much inventory. Once the order comes in, we make the shirt and we ship it out. I have uh, another video that you can see how we ship the items out. That's the process for the ones that are coming online, right? And as you can see, here are just different transfers that we have, different shirts that we sell. This is one of our best selling shirts right here, okay? And then we got St. Joseph. This is mainly for Christmas. This shirt and then this shirt that we haven't launched yet yet okay and then this is where we package it there's some other stuff that we got going on right and so again we grab the shirt that we have in stock we grab the transfer and we make the shirt and we ship it out to the customer and all that information we get from the online store you know if it's a bulk order right like the order the last video that i did or i think two videos ago where i'm making 30 shirts 40 shirts or whatever 100 shirts if those come in we don't have those in stock okay so this is just for an online store if we get a big bulk order from a local company or from a church we after we get their design and we work on it and we send it to the transfer company we order the transfers first of all this is a very important tip if if you want want to especially if you've never worked with them before you should always charge a deposit at least 50 percent deposit because what if you order the stuff what if you order the shirts and they don't show up or something happens right now usually if we've never worked with them before we ask them to pay a 50 percent deposit if we have worked for them before and we trust them and everything we just sometimes we don't even ask for anything up front and then they pay the whole thing once they come pick up the shirt. So we get the transfers, we get the shirts and we make them and then we just give them, you know, they come usually pick it up. So those are mainly for local orders. Sometimes we get messages for people that want us to, you know, from people from other states. What I usually advise is if you, you should always look for a local screen printer because you don't have to pay the shipping. But you know, if you wanna work with us, you know, I first advise you to save you money. Go with somebody local. If it's a big order, if it's a humongous order, go local. You'll save a lot of money in shipping because remember, 100 shirts, 50 shirts, that adds up for shipping. All right, so just to summarize, if we get an order online, we have the transfers in stock and we have the shirts in stock and we make it the same day and we ship it out the same day. The order comes in. You get the size, you get the transfer, you make it on the spot and you send it to your customers. Your customers are happy because the shipping is super fast. You're happy because you make an awesome profit, right? Because the transfers cost, they don't cost that much. The shirts don't cost that much. And you're selling it for $20, $29, depending on what you're, you know, what you're selling. And if you get a bulk order, then we will have to order that separately and then we order the shirts and then typically that's about five to eight days. So pretty much if it's an online order, when the order comes in, you should be receiving your order in the next three to five days. If it's a bulk order, it's probably five to eight days. So keep that in mind. That's the way we do things. Let me know if you have any questions. Hope you guys have a blessed day, a blessed journey, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.
Hey guys, so just before I end this video, it's pretty much, um, you know, the point of me doing this video is for you guys that are interested in making a business out of selling shirts, just showing you guys how simple this is, right? Where your, your most creativity is gonna take place is creating a design and finding a good company that can make you the transfers. But just imagine, just like you saw in the video, you can order the transfers 100 at a time or 200 at a time, which the more you order, the cheaper they'll be. You can have them stored in a safe place. You don't even have to have the shirts in stock, right? I like to have the shirts in stock because I like to get them right out. But you don't even have to have the shirts in stock. The order comes in, you make the shirt on demand. Think about it. That way you're not wasting any money on a lot of inventory that you're holding on to. Even if you don't have an online store, let's say you're starting off. Let's say you're selling shirts at your church or your flea market. Imagine doing this at a flea market where you just need the heat press. Go to the flea market, have a heat press, show the designs up there, right? Make one shirt so you can just show. And people will come and say, yeah, let me get that design large. All right, no problem. You make it in the spot, $20. Think about that. That's awesome. Look, when I learned how to do this, this was, this was pretty awesome. Even if it's just a side hustle, even if it's just something you do on the weekends, you can make an extra $100, $500, $1,000 a month. And if you really focus on it, you can make a lot more. So the point of this video is just to give you guys a view of how simple this business can be, right? This is simple. Get the orders, make the shirts, ship it out. So i um, definitely gonna make more videos on getting orders and all these different things, but you know, I'm giving you guys so much information and you can put start putting things together, right? Just look up all my videos in the past of how we ship things. I'll show you guys, I show you guys where to buy the material, how to ship it, and I show you guys so much. It's just a matter of taking action, right? And that's all I wanted to tell you guys for this video. Peace out.